I've chosen the sound plucked Hammond for this next example because it's a great example of how you can use the layers in Omnisphere to craft some instruments that don't exist really, but also remind you of instruments that do. So we've got this cool sound that has a little bit of organ reminiscent. I hear that like B3 click sound, but the click is also this fairy plucked harp. So what I've got here is a great example of utilizing the layers quite well. So this patch right now has two layers, a layer A and a layer B. Layer A is the fairy's plucked harp, and layer B is the Hammond hollow slow sound. Now, why don't we disable the other layer for the time being so we can hear just one aspect at a time. To do this, you simply go underneath the layer and you'll click on that tiny little light. I click on that and now I'm only listening to layer A. So it's this percussive element that does have a little bit of pitch to it. Now I'll disable layer A and instead enable layer B. Let's check that out. That's a Hammond organ that's been modified a little bit using this amplitude envelope to really give it a bit of a synth sound because you don't hear that hold that you would with a normal organ. You do a little, but it definitely decays quite a bit. And then you combine them both together and you got this cool plucky organ. And that's a really common theme in Omnisphere. It's the combination of real sounds to create unreal and ethereal sounds that are pretty neat. And it's using these layers to do so. So you want to really pay attention to what's going on in each layer and take a listen to each one individually by enabling and disabling them before you settle on your final product. <laughs> 